Okay, we're gonna do some code splitting here with Go. Okay, so let's clear this out. All right, so all right, let's uh, call us MQ here. OP video. Okay, CD OP video. Okay, so open my favorite editor, Video Studio Code, Visual Studio Code. All right. Damn phone. All right. <clears throat> All right. First, we're gonna. What we're gonna do is we're gonna call, cause it it, it should be more straightforward and go uh, on how to call outside packages, but it's not. So I'm just gonna um, you know, I'm gonna show you guys today, right? All right. So let's put in here. We're gonna start our main not go. All right. And so package main. Okay. We're gonna import format FMT like always and then we're gonna put uh, we're gonna put our, our funk funk main all right perfect okay and we're gonna call we're gonna make another file and we'll call this uh, well let's say that go okay all right perfect okay so in say we'll you know, we won't import funk and then we'll take it from here. All right. FMT. And in order for this to work, it has to be in the same package. So package, package main. So these both are in the same package main, all right? So we'll just name this, uh, we'll just say, Say hello. And it's kind of a this is a convention when it's going to be exported. You want to put everything. You want to put started. You know, starting with a capital letter, right? Uh, the function name starting with a capital letter. So in here, we're just gonna print line. And we'll just say, just say hello in all caps, right? Now, we should be able to do something like import, say, or something like that, right? But that's not going to work. <laughs> that's not going to work. This is, uh, I thought this was kind of quirky about Go or whatever, right? Okay, so. As long as it's in the same package, package main, and we got say in the same package, we can just call it regular like this, right? Okay. But what we have to do, let me open up a terminal here. Okay. What we have to do is we do go run, we put the main dot go, and then we have to put say dot go. And then it'll print out hello. If we don't put that say dot go on the end, it won't be able to find it. So you just basically have to call it like that, right? And let's see what we'll have if, if I do a go build. Yeah, it should put out an executable, and that'll be that. You see, and it'll put out that main executable. We can do that dot slash main. I'm on Ubuntu, and it shows you just like that. Okay. All right. And next, we'll uh, we'll include a, a package that's in another folder, a local package. Okay. Now we're going to create another folder here, and we're going to put this say dot go inside of that folder, right? So new folder, and we'll call this t package, okay, for test package, right? And we'll put the say dot go inside here, right? Come on, say that go go in there. Okay, move. Okay, goes in there. Let me let me just delete this and get this bullshit. Get this out the way. All right, get this. Um, all right, so we see in C uh, in T package, we should uh, we have that say hello there, right? All right. So in order for us to include this local package, right? We have to go mod init and name this package. Name this package. You know, whatever. 
Okay. Uh, let's name it OOP. Uh, we'll call it video because that's the name of the folder. You can name it anything else, but just the name of the folder is OOP video, so that's why I'm naming it. Okay, perfect. All right. So now what we can do is we can import. We have to start with OOP video slash T package. Okay. Yeah, OOP video that T package. Uh uh uh. We gotta bring that back. We'll call that TP. Okay. So we'll put TP dot. What is that? And say that go. And we gotta change this to. Uh, I forgot to say this. We gotta change this to T package. Okay. And then say hello. Okay. Say hello. Okay, should work right here now. You know what? I think we have to add say. I'll show you how to. Okay. So we'll go go run main dot go. T package that say is not in root. All right, OOP video T package. Let me see, maybe it works like that. All right, technical difficulty. Okay, what happened here was, um, this correct, all right? But what we, what I had here in this go mod, I, I had this spelled wrong. So just make sure you have it spelled right. And that's it. So you'll be able to include say from here because it's in the main package. You know, the convention really is to, uh, just name it the same thing. So name this T package dot go. Okay. That should still compile. Alright. And then if we want to add another file in here, now we can call this uh, a new file. We'll call this say dot go. Okay. And we'll just give this something that returns a string. So funk, uh, first let's say package, t package. Okay. And then funk, uh, um, let's put say name. I'm just trying to make this simple. Say name, and it'll return a string. Okay, so then we'll return. Let's say Bob Dole. I don't know. I just like that, right? All right. So now we can. Uh, now when we go in this main package here, we can also. But you know what? We'll just do it this way because it's the this is kind of the convention right here of doing it. If you if you're importing multiple packages, right? So now we'll put s equal to OOP video slash t package slash say. Okay. I don't know why this gives me an error, but bring this down so we can see a little more of the screen okay so we'll put s dot say name okay All right, let's see what happens say is not in the rule say that uh, go I think I have to put that under another uh, let me try that. Let me put that under another folder called say. And then we'll put it in here like that. And let's try to run this again. Okay. We 
we still we still haven't we haven't we just I just tested it right there. All right, so we gotta in order to print it out, we gotta put the bring in that um, FMT package. Then print line because say name is only gonna <clears throat> say name is only gonna return a string. Bob Dole. Okay, so there we go. And bam, we got Bob Dole. Okay, so that's how you split code and add local packages. You know, you can also go mod in it here and then you know give it a GitHub and then you'll be able to get it from GitHub. Um, you know, maybe I'll do that in like the next video or like uh, a video in the future. But I just wanted to get out of the way, getting local packages.